Hi there guys, um, this is a video response, um, well I say it's a video response, it's a, a video um, aimed at <clears throat> someone in particular, um, <clears throat> excuse me, I've got a frog in my throat, um, there's a video I've been doing the rounds, it's gone viral, um, I'm pretty a bit behind with the times I think, so I think it's been viral for a few weeks now, but I've only just discovered it. Um, it's a, uh, a video by a guy, I think the YouTube tag is Raging Robert. If you type Raging Robert into Google or into um, YouTube or whatnot, you'll see a load of videos um, come up regarding this guy. Um, I believe the guy's name is Joseph. Um, if you're watching this, Joseph, hope um, you're well. Um, but I know you've had a lot of video responses and stuff to this, so, you know, I'm just one of the millions. Um, but, um... There's a you know, the video has gone viral. That's what the the guy wanted, and um, it's it's done that because obviously I'm here in the UK and I, I've seen it, so um, it's made its way across the pond, and um, I'm sure it's made its way world worldwide. Um, if you type into YouTube, you'll see there's so many people um, that have um, commented and, and left Robert uh, or Joseph, sorry, video responses, um, and it'd be cool. If um, someone picked up on it, maybe a TV company or something, just so we could follow and document his progress. To give you a bit of background, I'll let, I'll let you, you go and watch the video. Um, I won't sort of go on about it here because um, I think it's better coming from Joseph or Robert's mouth himself um, explaining what's going on. I just want to sort of give my take on it and um, yeah, just offer an opinion on it, really. Um, if you look from my previous YouTube videos, um, it'll be not very exciting YouTube videos, but I'm on a weight loss journey myself at the moment. Um, this guy, I think he said he weighs about 700 pounds, and um, it's basically a video of him asking for help. Um, he's sort of saying, I just need help. He's tried diets and stuff like that. And it, it's very, um, in the UK especially, it's or, or worldwide, it's a problem, obviously, obesity, but um, there's a lot of programs on in the UK at the moment, super size, super skinny and but they they go over to America and sort of use America as an example of um this is sound really bad, but how not to be because the UK is cashing up America, the fattest nation on the planet and and they sort of send a person over to go and look at you know, go and live with someone who's obese, um uh, morbidly obese. Um but that's not to say that we don't have it in this country, alright, we don't have the statistics show that we're not I think it's a third of what America has at the moment, but we're catching up fast, and uh, you know, I, I know it won't be long before we'll be joining them um, in that respect if things don't sort of you know go you know end very quickly. Um, so I mean, it's quite obviously a big subject at the moment. Um, I'm you know personally say personally I've done I'm on a bit of weight loss journey myself. Have been since the start of uh, 2012, and. Um, yeah, just so I'm training for two marathons, so in April, so I'm like to run in Brighton Marathon and the London Marathon. So I've got um, I've just been following the running plan. Now I'm quite lucky in the sense that I, obviously you know I say lucky or unlucky, which you the way you want to look at it. But you know, even though I said I'm I'm trying to lose weight, I was sort of a 264 pound uh, bloke. So I'm 243 at the moment. So you know, it's light years away from anything that this guy is uh, is going through. Um, so he kind of can't, he's trying to get into his mindset. I don't think you can. You can't sort of get into his brain and say... Because I know people watch the video and they will moan and say, yeah, have you really tried everything? Um, that's not what I'm about, really. I don't... You know, I used to be like that. I used to sit and watch TV and say, come on, you know, why would you let yourself get that way? And why do you let yourself, um, you know... Why are you not aware of what you're putting in your mouth to get to that point? But I don't know. It's just the mindset, isn't it? It's yeah. I've made a lot of mistakes in my life, and if I look back at them now, I think, why have I made those mistakes? You know, at the time, they might be glaringly obvious to other people, but not very glaringly obvious to myself. So, um, you know, I can't think you can you get into this guy's mind. It's not really. You know, at the end of the day, it is what it is. He's asking for help, and I hope he gets it. I mean, what I really wanted to say, really, on this video is. Um, and if you're watching this, uh, Joseph slash Robert, sorry, I, just, I don't want to call you by one name or the other if it's not your real name. Um, you know, I hope you get I think you've done the, for me, the hardest step, I think. I mean, again, with me, I haven't had to um, ask for help because I'm not strong-minded, that sounds really egotistical. I'm not because 
there's a lot of things that um I need to improve in my life and things and this is what part of this weight loss journey is. Um, you know, I'm unemployed at the moment, I'm trying to find a job. Uh yeah, unemployed so trying to find a job and, and weight loss are my two main focuses at the moment. Obviously training for the marathon as well. But um so I haven't actually necessarily asked for help as such, uh, because I don't feel that I need it in that respect. Uh there's other facets of my life where I don't, I'm very independent, independent person, and I won't ask a lot of people for help. I won't. I don't know why. It's just something. So it's been straight away. Something ingrained in my memory, in my brain rather, that I, I will just, um, you know, I will just say to myself, look, you know, you can do it yourself. You can do it, and and it, I won't sort of ask for help until it's too late, or it's sort of when I really reach really the end of my tether. You know. I'm becoming a lot better at that now. I will ask for help. If I don't understand something or I'm not sure of anything, I will always ask for help. Um, for some reason, I always shied away from it. I don't know why. I think because possibly I'm quite a strong real person in the sense that I, can get, I know I can get things done, but I wasn't getting things done. So, obviously there's, a, there's something broken there, you know? Um, but I think, so in the weight loss sense, I've, I've been just sort of said to myself, right, I need to get on with it. And 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 that's come from within. Um, it has come from our people too. You know, a lot of people. My girlfriend, for example, sort of you know noticed I was putting on weight, and we used to have a lot of you know jibs about each other. But you know, your mindset is ridiculous. Like, she lost a lot of weight for like for around three stone, and I was putting on weight. And you think, how can that happen when you're with each other all the time? And she's exercising. And it's just my attitude was completely different. It, you know, it was my attitude. So I think that's what boils down to it. Is attitude. Um, and this guy's attitude, you know, it doesn't matter about the past or how, he, how and why he got in, into this situation. Um, it's about his attitude from now on, from now on in. And uh, and the steps he needs to make. He's asking for help. If he gets the help and doesn't make use of it fully, then there's only someone, there's only one person he's letting himself down, letting down and that's himself. So his attitude is good. He, yeah, it takes a lot of balls, I think, to get onto a uh, YouTube recorded video and and and... and pour your heart out on the camera and not a lot of people couldn't do it I couldn't do it when I first started and I found myself chatting for ages um, and I think that that's the first thing just putting your face out there and, and, and admitting defeat and sort of saying look I need help now but I think that's the big thing it's self dead just asking for the help that's one of the hardest things I think you can do um, sounds really minor but a lot of people won't do it they won't ask for help they won't say I need help I need help to in, in whatever facet it is and this guy's asking for help and you know, I really hope that he gets it. Um, he's realised there's a, uh, he's something needs to change in his life. His mindset's trying to change. And, you know, and I think fair play to him. Um, you know, we can all forget about the, think about the past and how, why, and how he got there. But that doesn't matter. What he does now is how he gets himself out of it. And the first step that he's taken is an amazing step to take. So, you know, I really hope he gets the help he needs. Um, and I've noticed just looking through YouTube, I can't really watch lots of them, but there's lots of people that have offered to help and offered their opinion. And also, you know, some guys from the fitness industry and stuff have offered uh, their help as well. So, you know, I hope that he gets something. I mean, obviously in the UK here, um, there's not too much I can do to help apart from giving support and record this video and say that, you know, I hope you get the help and I hope you go on to, to, to achieve what you want to achieve. Um, you're off to a great start already, so... Um, that's pretty much all I wanted to say, so it's not the most exciting video, but you know, I just thought I just saw the video and just uh, thought I'd make myself um, to put, put my opinion across, but just purely because I'm in I'm well, not in a similar situation at all, but you know, I'm trying to lose weight and I'm trying to shift my mindset to be a lot more positive, not just in weight loss, but in everything for my family and my friends and you know, my girlfriend and everything. So, you know, I know where he's coming from. But anyway, I hope you find the help. If you're watching this, I hope you find the help. Um you've done the amazing first step to ask for it. And I really, really hope that um, you know we can see your progress. And we can get updated somewhere along the line. Um, you've got your wish; it's gone viral. It's gone worldwide. So I hope you get all the help you need. Anyway, take care and uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hey guys, um, just a quick edit on the uh, video. Um, just uh, watching uh, uh, YouTube, uh, some catch up on some YouTube videos, and um, one of my uh, YouTube friends and um, Facebook friends as well, uh, Mike Bacon, twenty four seven. Go check his channel out. Um, he was doing something for Robert, um, well, not directly for Robert, but you know, uh, something to assist Robert, hopefully, in his um, weight loss or 
um, yeah, stepping, um, making the first steps to um, lose the weight and, and get there. Um, but he, he, his latest video, he was just saying that he uh, was in the gym last night and uh, watching the news on the uh, TV and saw that. Um, I'm not sure who the guys. I apologise for my ignorance. Being in the UK, I'm not sure who who the, the gentleman is. I believe he is he some sort of fitness guy. I don't know. I don't know. Sorry, I apologise. Um, but he um, he's sent out an olive branch to uh, to Robert to help him. Um, uh, yeah, to, to offer to help him to uh, lose the weight. And um, Mike was saying that it appears that Robert's accepted. So, which is all good news. So. Um, Hopefully, fingers crossed. We'll um, we'll hear some more very soon. Hopefully, he um, you know, we we send him our best. And uh, as Mike says, you know, hopefully he can stick to the plan and um, and achieve what he wants to achieve. So um, fingers crossed. But it's already given an update on this video because it kind of renders the previous video not pointless, but you know, gives a nice little end to it. So um, seems Robert's getting the help that he needs. So all good. Thank you, guys. Bye.